When are you at your best? I'm at my best when I'm doing something that I think is meaningful. Um, I think uh, in general, kind of 99% of us are just going through life for what it is. Uh, and then there's those rare moments where something just really sparks for me. I have something that I'm just extraordinarily excited about. And um, when I'm in that, when I'm concentrated and focused on that, I find that, I find I usually can be above average, but when I have that, I find myself just kind of soaring above everything. And, and part of it is just that I'm, I'm thrilled and happy with what I'm doing. Do you remember back to your childhood when, the, when you, you first remember that happening? There wasn't a whole lot in my childhood that I didn't spend a lot of time looking for things like that. I, one thing I really enjoyed in my childhood, it was we didn't have a lot of hobbies. My parents were um, immigrants and it wasn't the, we did not have the life where you go do piano and then this and then that and that. Um, the one thing we did was dance because my mom always wanted to be a ballerina. And so she had me, and she tried to get all of us, there's four, four girls, um, each child, she would just be like, okay, that's our thing, we're doing dance, you guys are going to dance classes. So me, two of us caught onto the dance thing. My older sister, my younger sister, they never really did much of it. But me and my, um, the two middle kids, me and my sister, we, we really enjoyed dance. So we would be in dance probably like four, four or five nights a week. We joined a company and we're dancing. So for me, that was something I loved and we did for fun. Uh, but otherwise, there wasn't a whole lot we did for fun. It was just kind of, um, you know, we just did what we needed to do. We had to do well in school. We hung out with our friends, but yeah. like more social. Uh, but the dance thing for me was like where my, where my passion lied growing up.